last time we spoke to you, you weren't sure if you'd be coming back. Was it uh, an easy decision for you in the end? Yeah, yeah, I think I was pretty set on coming back um, after our, pretty much our last game last year. Um, definitely some unfinished business and not just that, like I love Hobart. It's like a second home to me. Um, I got I got here on last two, I guess last Tuesday and as soon as I got off the plane I was just really happy and it just felt like this was the right place to be. So yeah, it was a good decision and it was definitely something that I wanted to do from the end of the season. Yeah. Was it Direction now with the move to the deck and a bit of a change in hierarchy. Did that reinforce your decision to sign up? Uh, no, I was pretty much ready to go. Yeah, I mean, the deck's awesome. They're making like big moves, it's exciting. Um, but yeah, I was ready to come back. I mean, I love the girls, that's why I'm here. I love the team, the fans, everybody. So that's my reasons for coming back. How do you say the squad this year? Yeah, we're good. Um, we're still working on a few like recruiting things and um, trying to find the right people to come into the program, not obviously, not only on the court but off the court as well. Um, obviously, that takes time. I'm trying to convince someone to come down to Hobart. Once they get here, they love it. But just trying to get somebody down here. So um, once we work on that, we fill those spots, and I think we'll be really good. You yeah, obviously, when you first joined, with, you know, the start of that success and you built up to that championship, and last year wasn't as great as everybody would have liked. I mean, clearly, obviously, on court results didn't sway you from, you know, coming and you say you feel as though there is some unfinished business to yeah. kick back on again? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, last year was tough. Um, you know, we've really built a, a, a really positive culture over the last few years, and I don't think that that changed last year. I just think on court, you know, we had games where we were losing by, like, six or less, and that's really frustrating. Um, and we had a few things that we needed to probably work out that we, we didn't in the end, and, and that's why I think when we come into this season now, you know, I know – what needs to be changed, Dwayne knows what needs to be done, what needs to be changed, and that's what we're going to do from the beginning, and hopefully we don't get to the middle of the season and we, we're like, oh, you know, we got to do this now. We can do it now and hopefully start getting the wins early on the board. Yeah. You been playing in the offices or No, nah, just went home, rested, enjoyed Christmas with the family for once in probably four years, and just been doing lifting and rehabbing and things like that, so. Yeah, I haven't really been playing much. Do you see yourself as the player that the team will build around, I suppose, this year? Uh, I mean, I would like to say that, I guess, because I would consider myself a leader. Um, fifth year, um, I think I've gained the respect of my teammates. You know, we have the young kids coming in, and they're, um, I know that they look up to me, and they look up to Kylie and Izzy and Alex and Emma and, and those older leadership players. Um, so, yeah, I mean, I would consider myself that player, but I also think that we got several more of those. Yeah. Did you have any other, was, did any other clubs come asking about your services? Or? Uh, yeah, yeah. But I just was pretty set on coming back. Yeah. yeah. Thank you. Okay.